Hello again, here is a video of how to make stroganoff. I'm using mousse tonight. Uh, you can use venison, beef, however, mousse is the option tonight. So you're gonna take an onion, however much you like, uh, dice that up along with some mushrooms, get them ready to saute. Then you're gonna pour a little flour in a separate bowl. You're gonna wanna season that flour and use whatever seasoning that you like. I kind of kept it simple here with some garlic salt, salt and pepper. And this is the base of your roux. So the roux is what you mix with the butter and the juices from the onion and mushroom. And that's kind of the base of your stroganoff, the base of your gravy. And as you can see, I've used um, a tender cut of the mousse. It's the top round steak. And here I'm just taking the chunks I've cubed up and mix them in the flour. I've got some butter and I've added some garlic on the stove. This is a pan ready to saute the onions and mushrooms. And don't be afraid to add a little extra butter. Like I said, this is the base of, of the gravy, the stroganoff. And the flour that is on the meat here is gonna actually soak it all up and, and that's what's gonna make it thick. And now that I've got all the meat in the pan here, what I'm trying to accomplish is get a sear on the meat. This will help hold the juice and some of the flavor in the meat and kind of just seal it up. And tonight I've decided to use chicken broth for the base. What I'm gonna be doing here for the next while as it's simmering is adding more broth, adding more flour, finding that happy me medium of thickness and creaminess. Um, the longer you simmer it, the better it's gonna be. Little tip for you too, if you add some oil to the boiling water for noodles, it will prevent it from boiling over. However, we're not really at risk tonight with the water level and amount of noodles that we we're using. And just before you're ready to take off the heat and serve, you are gonna wanna scoop some sour cream in there. This will just help with the creaminess and add another flavor level. And here we have got a finished product of some mousse stroganoff. Thanks for watching.